to it No, I don't need the trouble I can't think straight, I concentrate Feels like I'm seeing double You're on my mind, deep in my head. I think you're taking over me The feeling now, what I told you about The feeling now You guys, I just came out here because it's starting to snow. In Texas when it snows, which it did like once the 17 years that I was there, it melted as soon as it hit the ground. Actually kind of not melting as quickly. It's snowing. I'm so excited for this. Let it all fall and ruin a rubble This love we hold, not growing And I can see them changing all the feeling now What I told you about the feeling now My heart How will keep going? I know your viewers would love the word moist. So the chicken is really good. It's really moist. Mm -hmm. Nice spice to it, nice kick to it. Brussels sprouts. I hate Brussels sprouts, but these are good. day for John and I because it is our anniversary mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and so as celebration we're gonna try this Hagen dazs ice cream that John's been talking about for a while it is the pralines and cream flavor so good it's like caramelized nut or some sort So oh, okay. Cheers. Oh. oh, like the little crystal thing is the caramel? There, that's the knot, and then this is salt caramel. The brown stuff, yeah. The oozy bit is the salt caramel. Mmm. I feel like caramel, this is a good way to go. Look how unreal the sky looks today. It's beautiful.
just talk about my 2021 goals for this year so i'm gonna go over my goals really quickly with you guys and then at the end of the year i can do like a little review and see how i did so i just took the time to write it down really quickly i didn't do too many things just because i don't think that's very realistic i think that if you stick to just like four or five really core things that you want to change i think you are a lot more likely to be successful and stick to your goals okay so the first one is to take better care of my health um i feel like this is something that i did pretty well last year with but um i've had a lot of health issues in the recent years it is something that I've been wanting to go see somebody about and just kind of take better care of my overall health and also change my diet, obviously exercise more. But this also goes in hand with my mental health. Just keep in check just because 2020 was such a hard year here as it is on the entire world and I know that a lot of people also saw their mental health deteriorate with you know nations going into lockdowns and you're not being able to see your loved ones as often so i think now more than ever it is important to take care of your mental health as much as your physical health another thing i have on here is to kind of find myself again i felt like i knew what i wanted to do and like the direction i want to go in at the beginning of 2020 and then just everything in along with the world everything in my life changed um, the biggest change being that i decided to move to england with my fiance start our life here together it's something that i've wanted for a while now and it's kind of falling into place but now i feel like i'm ready for like that next chapter so meditate more is one of them and then create more obviously post more on youtube create more content on instagram and that's not just for the vanity sake i really enjoy creating i really enjoy that creative process of filming and putting a video together and yes it's very tedious editing sitting there in front of a computer for hours on end but in the end you have this video that you created that is just your product um, and it wasn't there the day before. I really enjoy that creative process and I would really like to make more time for that. I have a few financial goals on here. Um, also make more time for loved ones just because if there's anything 2020 has taught you is that you cannot take your loved ones, your relationships, or just other people in general for granted. Um, and then this is a goal that I wanted to do better last year but just because of like how crazy life got towards the end of the year I just didn't really have time for it but it's a very very simple very I feel like attainable goal um, and I made it attainable just so that I don't put too much pressure on myself and that is to read three books this year. I am very excited for this goal because I feel like it is attainable. So if I don't meet any of the other ones, I know I can meet this one. And speaking of, if you guys have any good book recommendations, please leave them down below. I am a sucker for self-help books and self-development, just anything in that genre. I also really enjoy like autobiography. I know the one that one of the books that I've been meaning to read for a while now is Michelle Obama's, I think it's called The Becoming or Just Becoming. Um, I've heard really good things about that one and that's been on my list for a while now. So yeah, just comment down below and let me know if you guys have any suggestions.